hope the world that the women in my life grow up in is one that is safe, where they can live the quality of life that they desire, where they can flourish and know their value and be treated fairly, and also be the best version of themselves. I hope that in the future, the topic of gender equality simply does not exist and becomes the norm. There will be no differences between men and women. I hope that by the time I have a family of my own, my children will grow up being driven, ambitious and know that there are no limits in life. They will know that everyone is equal, there are countless opportunities and they are supported 100% by not only their family, but their friends and especially their work colleagues. I want the women in my life, being my wife and my two daughters, to grow up in a world where they have a strong voice in the way that people are treated, they have a strong voice in the way that our planet is treated, and there aren't any limits in the way that they can achieve. The kind of world I hope that people in my life grow up in is one without prejudice and discrimination, where you're not treated unfavourably because you're a female or any minority, but you're not given a free pass either. I've been asked to reflect on what is the one thing that I'm most proud of about the women in my life. And to be honest, it's not a very easy thing to answer uh, because my wife and my daughter have so many great qualities. But I guess I have to pick one and it is the unwavering determination to have a go at anything regardless of the, the situation. I feel that they're in control of their own destiny. Uh, they're empowered and confident to make important decisions in their life. And they're also financially savvy and are able to plan for the future. There are so many things I'm proud of on the women in my life. Uh, you know, they are so strong, uh, loving, caring, uh, driven. Uh, you know, they can multitask, uh, you know, and, uh, and it's just, uh, you know, the list goes on. Uh, uh, you know, and I'm, I'm just so proud of them uh, for them being them uh, and, uh, and certainly them uh, just being who they are and the fantastic uh, women and people that they are. A key aspect that I admire uh, is their tenacity, their strength, um, their capability to be courageous and continue to make courageous decisions. The one thing I'm most proud about the women in my life is the commitment and compassion they exhibit both uh, personally and professionally. More than half the team I work with uh, are women who bring invaluable compassion to our customers and to their colleagues. Uh, their commitment is what has enabled us to try new things uh, to focus on safety, take on new challenges, and it's brought a great culture to the workplace and, and the team in, in general. We need to be aware of being inclusive in all situations, therefore giving women the same opportunities you know, to build these relationships and to get the same exposure. I think we've made huge traction, but we've got a hell of a long way to go. Everyone's voice should not only be heard, but respected. We won't agree on everything, that's for sure, but let's respect what we have to say and be respectful towards others of what we say. For myself as a parent, I feel we are um, role models to our children and it's important that we get the message right in um, what we teach our children, particularly around gender equality. Um, in teaching them that it's important in life to make sure we treat everyone as, as equal, support and embrace everyone's unique abilities, um, help them to grow as a person, to become the very best that they can be, regardless of, of gender. Um, I think as parents, that's our responsibility and um, our children are the future, so it's important we get that message right with them now. As we celebrate International Women's Day, I want to take this opportunity to say thank you to all the amazing women in our lives and their achievements. In the spirit of this year's theme, Each for Equal, we have some great examples in our workplace of people challenging the status quo and contributing towards shaping our workplace and personal lives. I know at times it's a challenge, but come on, it's wholesome and we're up for it. Let's take action for equality. 
Don't settle for what is, commit to change and help create gender equality.